Hello guys, today's video is going to be about rehoming of X battery chickens and uh, what I'd like to do is bring in a site that we use so if you're interested you can see where to go to now they're called the British Hen Welfare Trust if I just bring that in like that you can see they're all here what you do is you go onto this site it's called the British Hen Welfare Trust you go onto this site, uh, you register, you register your interest, have a good old read all around this, you can see, you know, there's their contact details, emails, etc, fundraising things, um, subscribe for their newsletters, but what you do, you uh, go in and you register, and there's all different things about the egg industry, rehome some hens, you see, Register online as a starter guide, some frequently asked questions. Uh, the hen collection dates. Now, we picked our latest ones up yesterday, which was the uh, 25th of May uh, 2019. Um, there's things about cockerels, etc. etc. And it's, this is a brilliant site and is a brilliantly helpful people that you can get all kinds of advice from it's really simple though register to get some hens and when the next date comes up in your area they will email you and uh what they do ask for is a donation um now you can make your donation once they tell you yes you're going to get some hens you can donate a donation is normally they kind of expect five pound per hen yeah because there were some people taking 20 hens and giving a donation of two pounds and stuff so they've kind of changed it up a little bit but you can um, roughly five pound a hen you know if you can't afford that then maybe they'll, they'll you know i think they'll take any donation but it's kind of expected at about five pound a hen and then they will give you if i have a look on here uh, hen dates they'll they'll say to you yes we've reserved them and these are the places you can pick them up from Berkshire Bristol Cambridge Cornwall Cumbria Derbyshire Devon Dorset Essex Hampshire it's basically all all the all the counties as you can see right through Wales and it's the only in Ireland uh, there's probably an Irish welfare trust out there. Anyway, these are these are as I said, brilliantly. What's his name, people? So I just wanted to make this as as for the the start of my new series we're making about rehoming hens. As you can see so far, uh, we've been rehoming with them now for about eight years, roughly, uh, and so far they've rehomed 705,208 hens now the hens are about 18 months old yeah and what it is is when the farmer when the hens stop producing eggs at a, the rate of one a day yeah the farmers it's no longer viable for them so what they do is the good farmers this is is allow these people to come in and rehome them yeah now you know they're battery hens and as you will see in the upcoming video that comes with this they're not in the best of conditions because they're battery hens they're pretty bald some of them have leg problems fortunately the ones we got yesterday aren't too bad um but we've had some awful looking ones you know but it doesn't take long two weeks two to three weeks bit of tender loving care you know and the feathers are coming back etc but we'll explain more as we go along on that but um these hens will still lay on average about 320 eggs a year yeah so pretty much one a day for you know the odd day they don't and they're good for that for a good couple of years so don't be put off thinking oh it's past its sell by day because it's 18 months old it's going to live well if they looked after well we had one recently that lived to seven 
you know, which is old for a chicken. The average is sort of four to five, I think, or three and a half to five, you know. But you're giving an animal that's done a great service to to the food industry a lovely last few years of life, you know, in a, especially if you can have a nice run and stuff. I mean, these some of these hens have never seen the light of day. So when they touch grass for the first time and stuff, well, as you can see by the picture, that, you know, next to the dogs, they're very friendly. They, they're a bit skittish for the first couple of days, but it's really worthwhile doing, and you, I guarantee you will love the way it makes you feel 